Before the collapse of the Pakatan Harapan government, Dr. Zulkifli Ahmad was in charge of the country's response to the COVID-19 outbreak as health minister. Many saw him as doing a good job, leading to various quarters including political rivals to suggest reappointing him as the health minister before Prime Minister Mohidin Yassin announced his cabinet. Speaking at a forum organized by Pakatan Harapan last night, Dr. Zulkifli said he was willing to help the federal government, but it will not be in the capacity of minister because that would mean legitimizing the Perikatan national government. Jadi, uh, saya bersedia demi rakyat, yeah. never to ever legitimize this government that has come into a power grab. So they offered it, it to you, but you said no? No, I, I said no, but... but Kalau demi rakyat, kalau dia come in with national service kind of thing, this is demi rakyat, how could you, you are so partisan, you are so political. I said, no, I'm ready to serve, dalam apa juga capacity, but not as a minister. Currently, Dr. Zulkifli is in charge of a special Selangor task force to tackle the COVID-19 outbreak after being appointed by Menteri Besa Amiruddin Shari. He said he was prepared to help other states if his assistance is needed. Are you open to helping other state governments if they yes, call for help? Yes, more than happy, yeah. especially our Pakatan state. Beyond Pakatan state pun tak apa. I'm also with this team, I would want to help you know, Penang, particularly in the Grishmilat, and as well other neighboring state. I mean, uh, more, more than happy. Because it's a health issue. It's a health it, issue. Yeah. It tried, it, it tra- dia merentasi semua. Tetapi kerana kerajaan negeri Selangor yang mengambil, yang memberikan saya peluang ini, saya pastinya akan memberikan tumpuan pada negeri Selangor dahulu dan semua negeri-negeri yang lain, khususnya kawan-kawan dalam Pakatan Harapan dan juga negeri-negeri yang lain.